found the problem. Seems I must have dropped the nut into the crankcase. Yeah, that, 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 that's what it was. So that, <laughs> that's obviously what caused this. Oh it has nothing to do with the piston ring. <laughs> that's a piston ring. Or the large pieces of piston that are falling out of my motor. <laughs> I think this particular piece here might be why it wasn't turning over, so I'll just move that over. We'll put her back together. This, I mean, this spins freely. What's the, what's the problem, really? Yeah. This piston ring might be in the way as well. <laughs> Uh, <laughs> I think this one might be slightly, uh, slightly confused. Well, that's the broken one, right? This is the broken. No. Oh, dude. Oh, we got, oh. We got oh. more than one problem. Okay. okay so, okay. so this one that snapped is actually from the number seven. So number seven rod snapped completely, and the piston is now wedged. Move your hand there. Is now wedged in the top dead center position. Whereas number eight, it's is if we disintegrate. seized. <laughs> this bolt is somehow like this is. Oh, loose now. Huh. But this somehow this bolt is backed off, which is weird since we double checked our torque about four times. But I can spin it out by hand. So somehow we There are pieces of piston scattered fucking all the way everywhere. through this block. I think we got we have to well, of course. None of this is salvageable. I don't think so, dude. On the bright side, I have some scoring in a cylinder, which means it'll have to be bored out. But the hole is not actually in the cylinder, so it's fixable. So we can re-weld this block and put some forged goodness inside? Yes. And that will be nice. Fuck! <laughs> There's fucking piston bits everywhere! Oh my god! It's fucking all, it's like gravel just got poured into the motor. I'm pretty sure this is the biggest piece. Well, you can see the top on the other side of there. That's the, uh, the top half. The dish. It's fine. <laughs> There's a piece of ring way down in there. I can't quite reach it, but yeah, you can see it. Wow. Um. <laughs> this bearing is gone. Maybe it fell right the fuck out. How? It's not know. possible. Dude, this, I'm this gonna go to Lordco and I'm gonna get a new engine because my bearing is obviously <laughs> what fucked up since it's that loose and that blew my motor up. It had nothing to do with us being completely retarded or incompetent. Mostly no. incompetent. It, it, it was absolutely that bearing. Hmm. I mean, I'm not sure why this rod snapped in half, <laughs> but it was definitely this bearing. Wow. Oh, there's some more piston stuck in there. <laughs> Between the rod and the journal. Oh, this is epic. It's all the way on the other side of the motor. Oh, my God. Well, that's what happens when you fuck up a 75-cent O-ring on your modified oil pickup tube. Yeah, we'll show you that shortly. This is Sean and Steve. Fucked up motor. <laughs>